Hi there, my name is John Stevens, pastor of Zion Lutheran Church in Oregon City, Oregon, and we're part of the ELCA, and this is the Dollar Store Children's Sermon blog, which we take a look at the lectionary text and we tie it to an item from the Dollar Store. And this week is the sixth Sunday of Easter, and I'm looking at the first lesson out of Acts and the gospel lesson out of the Gospel of John. And in Acts, we have the story of Lydia, who is the cloth, the purple cloth dealer, who ends up um, being converted. And in the text, it talks about how she felt it in her heart, and her heart was opened. And I brought along with me uh, a little heart here, and this reminds me of this story when Paul is talking to Lydia, and her heart is open and it's almost like the light shines in her heart and you click this and you can see the light shines in and it's open and it, as you can see okay. and in the gospel lesson Jesus tells the disciples and tells us do not be afraid do not let your hearts be troubled and I think of when Jesus comes into our hearts and we do not let our hearts be troubled it shines bright. Now in Acts, when Lydia ha feels her heart being opened, she is so thankful. She invites Paul uh, over to her house and wants to give thanks. And it reminds me that when our hearts uh, are open, we want to give thanks. And what are some of the ways that we might be able to give thanks? We can give thanks by sharing God's love with one another. We can give thanks by helping out in our family. We can give thanks. There's so many different ways that we can give thanks. But this reminds me, this little heart reminds me that God is in our hearts and works with us. Now what's interesting about this heart is can this heart turn on itself? No. Can this heart make itself bright? No. It takes someone coming in and turning it on for that light to shine. Just as Lydia's heart is open and we say do not let our hearts be troubled, it's God that comes to us and God that says to you and I, I love you so much, I'm going to work in your heart. And we as people of God, as children of God, get to give thanks for that. We get to say thank you God for working in our hearts and for making us shine bright. So that's the children's sermon for this sixth Sunday of Easter and this is uh, called a touch light and it's found at the dollar store. I think it's going to cost a little more than a dollar because the batteries are not included but you can find those at the dollar store as well. So this is the touch light and, the, and our light and our hearts shine bright. So thank you for stopping by and I hope you have a blessed week.